Hi, howdy, hey, ladies and gentlemen. Your pal starts here today with a, another video. Today, we're doing Sandy Flat Survival, uh, which is just a modified um, overall uh, super flat preset with, uh, the, with the biome changed and the terrain changed. And it should be a little bit of a bigger challenge to navigate than regular super flat, but it'll still be a challenge nonetheless. So, uh, we are here not only to play super flat, but we're also here to talk. Uh, I'm very well aware that talking is not normally something you see from me, but uh, it's going to be something you're going to see from me right now, as I have something important to tell all of you. Or at least those who care. Right. Um, I will be leaving for a few months. One, two, uh, a few. A few good months. Uh, just uh, so far uh, an undetermined amount of time as I am going on a trip. That's right. You heard it here first, ladies and gentlemen. I, the horrible, horrible scheduled YouTuber, your pal Starch, am vanishing for months at a time and then coming back uh, at an also undetermined amount of time. Crazy, I know. That just doesn't sound like me at all. Yeah, I'll be the first to admit that does sound actually quite like me, but uh, this is something that I I think I I will quite enjoy. I, pardon the squishy sound of the slimes; they can get on one's nerves. Um, <clears throat> as far as uh, well, updating you guys, you have stuck with me through a lot of. Uh, hiatuses, gaps and uploads, absolutely horrible streams, uncoordinated streams, just to mention a few things, but through it all, and I do mean this, uh, you've stuck, you've stuck around. You've generally made an effort to, uh, at least try to persist with the content and persist with me, and I genuinely appreciate that. And it's something that I will always be thankful for, to have that kind of, uh, I'm not going to say loyalty, because that's just weird, but to have that kind of dedication from people, that really does mean a lot to me. And I am genuinely thankful that I can say for certainties that I have a dedicated enough audience that allow me to kind of do these kinds of videos. Uh, anyway, I, I keep getting distracted and I shouldn't do that, so. But let me be the first to... Holy goodness. Somebody's mad. What was I saying? Ah, yes, of course. Uh, I skipped that one already. Um, God, what was I saying? Oh, uh oh, get me out of there. Nothing is in there for me at the moment. Um, ah, um, 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 uh, what am I gonna make up my mind on what to say? <laughs> oh, tower. <clears throat> I almost said I'm there. Caught myself though. Caught myself. I didn't. I almost did, but I didn't. Whoa! That's a steep drop. But yeah. Uh, ugh, damn it. <laughs> but yeah, I have a solid kind of framework of family out uh, and about. Uh, quite a ways away from where I am at the moment. But... I am... I'm happy. Uh, I'm going on my trip. I I probably won't be flying out. You know, this video will probably be up before I even get on my plane that I think about it, but... Um, it's definitely... It's definitely something that I'm looking forward to doing. It's not, it's not a surprise for me. It's not a scary thing for me. I am genuinely looking forward to seeing how the world changes for the better in my eyes and I think it will I think there will be a lot of good things about me 
taking some time away from here. And I've, you know, I've, you know, I've graduated recently. Um, and, uh, no longer have a job, but, you know, that's fine. Uh, things happened. The, the point is, and I, I can understand if you've, if you've misunderstood, the, the point is that I am... Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna run back and grab some dirt. Uh, no, the, the point is that I am... The world has pretty much opened up for me. I have a lot of paths I can take in life, a lot of options to pursue, and a lot of which I don't know what to expect of. <clears throat> and I know it's not necessarily something I, you know, so scary as to cause me fear, but there's a lot of stuff that I have yet to experience that I really do want to experience. Ouch. And I think that I can do that on this trip. Uh, I will be back. Uh, this isn't an announcement of I'm leaving and I'm never coming back. No. This is more of a, hey, it's nice to hear from you, but I'll be going away in a bit. Because I feel like I owe it to you who have stayed with me for as long as you all have. To kind of keep you, if not informed, just kind of updated with current events. It just feels like the right thing to do, you know? I, I kind of feel like I owe it to all of you few who've tuned into the streams, watched me do ridiculous things, talk about <laughs> stupid and ridiculous stuff, that kind of thing. But... Uh, the traction I've gotten the last few days, I wouldn't have been able to achieve in the slightest without, you know, at least a little bit of influence from the wonderful people that cons consistently keep up with my stuff and tune into every video I make. And don't let me forget the people that continuously comment on every single one of the videos I make. That, that right there is some dedication, I will say. So, yeah. Uh, I genuinely really do appreciate all of you, uh, my pals, my friends, for sticking around when you probably could have up and left, for continuing to comment, leaving your feedback on my videos, I really all appreciate it, and tuning into the streams, talking to me via chat, that's always, it's all, always nice too. Uh, and like I said, this isn't a goodbye, I'm not like dying, I'm not leaving, I'm not abandoning, you know, I'm not gonna be gone forever, anything, anything like that. No, I'm, I'm just, I'm taking a trip. I'm taking a trip, and it may not be a big deal to some, but it is for me. I've lived a pretty stationary routine, and I'm not gonna say sna stagnant, but <laughs> persistent and repetitive sort of, uh, life thus far, and I'm excited to see what Ranching At can do for me. So, uh, you know what, if this whole wall idea works out pretty well, couldn't I just do, like, this kind of thing? And build it up a little bit? I don't want you to, like, jump over it, though. <laughs> I am invincible. This works. Haha. -ha. Oh, what? I forgot that those kinds of slams are one block tall. I'm currently outside, so I don't have unnecessary bits of cactus just hovering around. And while we're here, let's grow some more. There we go. Uh, anyway, I apologize. I got distracted once again. Um. Going through immense combat right now. There we go. Anyway, so that's pretty much about it for the main reason I'm on here, but there's some other stuff that has been going in, on in my life that I'd like to talk about if you care to listen, which you don't really don't have to if you don't find you want to, but if you do listen, it'll be a kind gesture just the same.
Excuse you. What a jerk, am I right? Ah, of course, nighttime. Oh, don't let me forget such a thing. <clears throat> anyway, in terms of uh, what's new with the world, life, and everything else, uh, I've really, and I mean by really, I mean I've really gotten uh, my soul sucked into uh, tabletop RPGs, D&D, &D, uh, ICRPG. I haven't played Pathfinder, but I've been wanting to, and I have never been more happy. It's a really cool place, I guess. Not to necessarily be all pretentious and say that I have creativity to share, but I like telling stories with my friends and seeing them enjoy it. How did you get in there? It's a really fun thing for me, and I like doing it. So, <clears throat> every now and then, I make just a random character that has no reason for existing, but does anyway. And recently, I made a character. And I use Hero Forge to kind of realize my characters, because I can build the class and everything in D&D Beyond. But to get the look of them right, I need to like actually see them and kind of get a feel for their personality. And so I made him, I made uh, the guy that I, the character that I was making, I don't remember his name off the top of my head, but I made him in Hero Forge. And he's got uh, the sideburns, the mutton chops with the, with like the mustache without the chin, I forget what that's called. But uh, he's got that kind of style going on with him. And then from that, uh, well, cause obviously he looks cool as heck. Whoa. I don't think I've seen a, did you just take this job? Are you even qualified to call yourself a cleric? Apparently you are. I stand corrected. Um. <laughs> a what? A blacksmith? Holy crap. I didn't know blacksmiths still generated with, with lava. I thought they changed that, but apparently not. This changes things uh, quite egregiously, it does. Holy crap. Okay. Sorry. Uh, don't mind me getting distracted. Um. Wow. Go away. <sighs> Sorry, I thought I heard something. Uh, anyway, um, <laughs> uh, well, 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 well. <laughs> uh, listen, man, I appreciate all that you've done for me. I really do, but uh, we need to have a talk called "I Need the Iron You Have in Your Body." Okay. Okay, okay, okay. 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 <laughs> Pardon me. Uh, forgive me. This is now main uh, HQ, by the way. In case you couldn't tell, this lava is important. I have been under the opinion that there was... Or under the impression, pardon, that there was no way to get stone, but I completely forgot about blacksmiths. Though this lava isn't renewable, we need trips on for that. Anyway, before I continue to divulge myself into further and further and deeper and deeper pits of uh, distraction, which is a very possible thing that has happened to me on many occasions. What's going on, man? Uh, I hate to make this place mine, but I do kind of need it, so you're going to be... Subjected to the outside world, methinks. I'm gonna put like a thing of cobble up there so he doesn't walk onto it. Uh, you know what? This is your place, and I don't want to change too much about it, so you get to keep it still. <laughs> 